Jellyfish Lake is a marine lake located in Palau. Millions of golden jellyfish migrate across the lake daily. Jellyfish Lake is around 12,000 years old and contains two main types of jellyfish, golden jellyfish and moon jellyfish. The lake is sufficiently isolated and the conditions are different enough that the diversity of species in the lake is greatly reduced from the nearby lagoon. Jellyfish Lake is connected to the ocean through fissures and tunnels in the limestone of an ancient Miocene reef. Jellyfish Lake is stratified into two layers, an oxygenated upper layer and a lower anoxic layer. All organisms that require oxygen live in this upper oxygenated layer, including the jellyfish and a few species of fish and copepods. The lake is connected to the sea via three tunnels that lie near the surface. The tunnels channel tidal water in and out of the lake. It is one of around 200 saline meromictic lakes that have been identified in the world. Meromictic meaning that it has layers of water that do not intermix. This is caused by three key features of the lake. One, it is surrounded by rock walls and trees, which substantially block the wind flow across the lake that would cause mixing. Two, the primary water sources for the lake, which are rain, runoff and tidal flows through tunnels, are all close to the surface. And three, the lake is in the tropics, where seasonal temperature variation is small, and so the temperature inversion that can cause vertical mixing of lakes in temperate zones does not occur. Snorkeling in Jellyfish Lake is a popular activity for tourists to Palau. Tourists are required to obtain a pass to access Jellyfish Lake. The Rock Islands and Jellyfish Lake Pass is $100 and is valid for 10 days. Scuba diving by tourists in the lake is not allowed. This is because the bubbles from scuba tanks can harm the jellyfish if they collect beneath their bells. And the anoxic layer contains high concentrations of hydrogen sulfide, which can be absorbed through the skin of the diver and lead to death. If the anoxic layer is avoided, the lake does not pose a risk for snorkelers or other tourists. Although both species of jellyfish living in the lake have stinging cells, in general they are not powerful enough to cause harm to humans. It is reported that the stings are only noticeable on sensitive areas like the area around the mouth. Saltwater crocodiles are native to Palau, but there has only been one death attributed to them in recent times, and they are generally not considered to be a threat to divers.